Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Today I just wanted to make a video about some of the things that I'm thankful for this year. I know that Thanksgiving is already going to be over by the time this is posted, but there's a lot of things that I'm thankful for this year and I want to talk about it a little bit. Before I get into the video, I just want to say that it's raining and it's really windy outside. So if you hear any noises, that's what those noises are from. So if you've been watching my videos throughout this year, you probably know that this year has definitely been a struggle at times. It's been very draining and the struggle has been incredibly real at times, but it's definitely been a year where I learned a lot. Around this time last year was when I really started to get involved in the Cambrian community. I got involved because transit cuts were supposed to be happening and I was really scared and I didn't really trust my generation to do anything about it. So I did what any involved young millennial would do and I asked the boomers for help. So basically I got involved with some of the neighborhood associations in my area and they helped a lot and we were able to preserve some bus routes. And I also learned a lot more about other issues that are going on in the community and that it's okay to disagree with people and that it's okay to work with people that you don't agree with on every single issue because a lot of these people have very different views on housing but anyways i learned a lot i ended up actually becoming the youngest member of the cameron community council which is kind of the biggest neighborhood association in my area and obviously being on the cameron community council is really cool but what's even cooler is just having a community that's actually there to back me up and to teach me things and to call me out when i screw up some of you probably know that i moved around a lot when i was a kid i think i lived in over 10 houses or something like that so i never really had that sense of community but i do now and that's really what i'm the most thankful for this year so i'm so thankful for my family and friends like always but what really stands out to me this year is a community that i've gained and unfortunately i gained this community from some unfortunate events but as i say all the time you know it's really important to look at these bad situations and make the best out of them and try to look at the positive and that's really what the positive has been for me and obviously it's led to a lot of great opportunities for me i ended up getting a job through all this working for someone that i've looked up to for a really long time that i've just been able to do so many cool things and i've just been able to watch people's views change and watch people become more open to new ideas it's just cool to see people's views change over time and to see your own views change over time i feel like i'm kind of getting rambly about this but yeah i'm basically really thankful for the community that i built this year and all the people that i've met this time last year i wasn't planning on staying in cambrian park or even in san jose but now i am because I I actually have a community here and there's so many people that i've met this year that i couldn't imagine my life without so i think that's pretty much it i'm super thankful for everything that has happened this year and i'm really excited to see what happens in 2020 so thank you all so much for watching this video let me know what you're thankful for down in the comments below stay awesome and i'll see all of you very soon with a new video goodbye